us look at question 17. 17 leads in the following diagram a b c d and e lie on the circumference of a circle center o b d equals b e angle c a d equals 18 degrees and angle b e c equals 51 degrees find angle a d c b angle b e d c angle e b c so when you look at the circle theorem you notice that most of these questions are easy to answer and as long as you understand some few principles so some few properties of the circle theorem once you understand this you will notice that this question always is an easy question that you would easily find easy to get in an exam so from this let us find as many angles as possible from the few principles so i've gone to a bigger screen so that we're able to see clearly so the first thing that we know is we have a diameter because it's passing through the center so this is the center and we have uh, the angles in a triangle which at one side as a diameter so this is angle angles in the semi circle so if the angle is passing through is touching one of the circumference and one side of it is in the diameter that angle is in 90 degrees so the angles in the semi circle are always in 90 degrees so this angle we know this angle itself is 90 degrees because it's an angle in the semi circle because of this in diameter number two we look at in angles in the same segment angles in the same segments are equal so we have a chord let us start with some few ones so we have this chord then starting from b and c this angle and this angle they are the same because they are angles in the same segment they are sharing the same chord but in they are all touching the circumference so if this is 51 this angle should also be 51 degrees then if that's the case we know that that entire angle is 90 degrees the remainder of what it means here should be 90 minus 90 minus 51 which should give me 39 degrees so this angle should be 39 degrees so if that's the case then what i can do is i can find some other angles what are the other angles that i can find i know this is a chord then this they are starting from d and dc they are touching the circumference so if this is 18 degrees this angle should also be 18 degrees that's what that means so i found some few angles then what's the other angle then again i'm starting from c and d then i'm eating this point so again that angle should also be 18 degrees because we have this minor segment and the, on the other major segment so this angle should be 18 degrees then what other angle can i find what other angle can i can i find i know these two are equal if these two are equal it means this angle this entire angle and this entire angle should be the same should be equal because these two are equal so what i need to find is to find the total angle here it will be 51 plus 18 degrees this will give me 19 plus 50 to give me 69 69 degrees so the entire angle is 69 degrees so it means this angle should be 69 for it to be 69 i already have 39 so this angle should be this angle up to here should be 30 degrees okay so i know that angle so if i know that angle then how can i find this angle how can i find this angle so to find that angle the only thing that I need to do is I need to multiply this, uh, add the 269, then subtract this from that. So it will be y plus this angle, which is 69, plus 
this angle which is 69 must be equal to 180 degrees so y is equal to 180 degrees minus 69 plus 69 to be 120 plus 18 which is 138 so 138 then 180 minus 138 I'm going to get 42 so this angle should be 42 degrees so y is in 42 so I can have 42 here so I'm just trying to find as much as I can before I look at the question so now I can go and look at the questions so the question is asking me to find in angle a d c which is this angle that angle already found it is 90 degrees then we go back angle b e d b e d which is this angle b e d so that angle is in 69 we've already found it to be 69 so that is in 69 degrees remember we added 51 and 18 then lastly angle e b c angle e b c so it's this angle angle e b c have we found that angle so it's 42 plus 18 degrees this angle E B C so you see 42 plus 18 so that's 0 then that's 60 so that's 60 degrees so we have 60 degrees and go E B C so once you do that you are good to go you get these full marks so thank you for watching if you haven't downloaded the companion app Please check on the description section or go to the Play Store and type SGCSE, which is the General Certificate Secondary Education Exams ECZ. Then you'll be able to find so much resources. You'll be able to find quizzes. You'll be able to compete with your friends on the leaderboard, find YouTube, and past papers with a detailed solution.